Typhoon Kaimegi has left at least seven people dead after it swept through China's southern provinces. Nearly six million people were affected. Residents in Guangdong province have started to get back to normal. CCTV's Ule reports from one of the cities hard hit in the province. Typhoon Kalmiji brought strong winds and heavy rains to Zhangjiang city, tearing down trees and causing serious flooding. Now, as the weather condition slowly improves, it is cleanup time for the locals. Nearly all the stores of the vendors have suffered the flooding for six hours yesterday afternoon. Chu Kang Fu's store is selling fishing equipment. He said many of his goods were damaged by the seawater and he lost over tens of thousands of yuan. We have been here since 7 o'clock this morning, cleaning up the goods in the store. There is still much work to do, and the power supply also has not resumed yet. Power is expected to resume this afternoon, as over 30,000 others have been left hanging for over 24 hours. Residents took the time to straighten up whatever that was left valuable, cleaning up their homes and stores. There was always yet another pile of debris and rubbish on the streets. Newly stolen from the store. When a strong wind blows over large amounts of rubbish on the streets, we will need another three days to clean it up. According to the Guangdong Provincial Bureau of Civil Affairs, the total financial losses from the damages have run over 1.3 billion yuan, or over 200 million U.S. dollars. With the help of assistance from local authorities, more than 1.1 million people affected in the province are now trying to restore normalcy in their lives piece by piece. Wu Lai, CCTV, Zhangjiang, Guangdong Province.